Good afternoon, everybody. How are y'all today? Good. Okay, my name is Sarah Key, and most of you already know me. And guess what? I'm a student, just like you are. Did you know that? Yeah. You did? I am a student at the University of Alabama. Have you ever heard of that place? No. It's a college, and I am taking classes there for food and nutrition degree. So what I'm going to do today is teach you some things that I've learned getting my food and nutrition degree. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at these two plants. Have you ever seen plants like this? Yes, I have. You have? Okay, this is plant number one. So I've got it up here. I'm going to set this underneath plant number one in just a minute. But this is plant number one, and this is plant number two. Do you think they look different? Yes. They do, don't they? I want us to think about some words that would describe these plants. So I'm going to set this one down for just a second. Let's think about this one first, plant number one. Emma? Um, healthy. It is. That does look healthy, doesn't it? I'm going to write these down so we can remember what we, what we said. That plant definitely looks healthy. Okay, what else? Um, it's uh, alive. Alive. Good. I've got one in mind. New. New. Okay, good. You got one? It's straight. It's what? Straight? Good. Y'all are thinking of something that I didn't think of. Okay, let's think of one more. Yes? Um, uh, it's not leaning over like the other one. Very good. It's not leaning over, and that would be straight, wouldn't it? What about the color? <gasps> it's it's green. bright green. It's green. Good. That was the first thing I noticed. It's, it's nutritional. Yeah, Very I'm good. <laughs> I like that. Okay, but I said just one more. We could go on and on and on, but we're just going to stick with those. And now, okay, well, you can be the first one uh, to describe this that one. That one is pretty. It, it is very pretty. Okay, that tell one, me a word that would describe this one. That one's really dead, and it won't come back alive but only if you hold it. Good. It is dead. It's definitely dead. And that means you didn't make, you didn't give it good sun, and you didn't give it good water, and no soil. Okay, good. I want you to remember that. We're going to talk about that in a minute. Okay. It don't have no water. It doesn't have water? Okay. We'll put that. It's not really one word, but that's and okay. And it's no sun. Okay, anything else? Think about color. We said that one was green. Yeah, that this one does have green on it. But what else does it have? Color. It has a brownish color. It's got a lot of brown dark, spots dark on it, doesn't green. it? Dark green. Brown. When you think about healthy plants, should they be green or brown? Green. Most healthy plants should be green, shouldn't they? One more. There's one dead plant to this. This is gay. It is a Let's listen. It's um bending over. It's not straight. Leaning over. Okay. Bent. Okay, good. Okay. Alright, I want everybody to hold your arm up in there like this with your fist in a ball. If you would want to be, if you were a plant, and you would want to be plant number one, I want you to hold up one finger. And if you would want to be plant number two, I want you to hold up two fingers. Which plant would you rather be? All of your arms up in the air, and either hold up a one or a two for me. A one if you want to be this, this plant right here, or a two if you would want to be this plant. Good. I think everybody agrees. We would want to be this plant, right? Yeah. Why? Why do you think this plant, and you're right, this plant is a lot healthier than this plant. And I like to what do you both. think this plant got that this plant did not get? Yeah. Emma, what do you think? Water, Thank you for sunlight. raising your hand. What do you think this one got? Water, sunlight, and moisture. Water and sunlight. And, and water is what we're going to talk about today. And moisture. Mm -hmm. that, is, that is water. And soil. <coughs> today we're going to talk about water. And just like these plants need water to be healthy, we need water to be healthy. Our bodies need water to be healthy. When we don't get water, we feel more like this plant, sluggish. Have you ever heard that word? No. Yeah. What do you? How do you feel when you feel sluggish? It's actually, still alive. Um, um, Raise your hands. You, well, we don't really feel dead, but we just don't feel good. You feel yucky when you when you feel sluggish. When our bodies have water and we're healthy like this plant, we feel good. We want to play and have a good time, and we're awake. Uh, you, want, you want to go outside and play, have fun, honey? That's right, and we want to do that, don't we? Yeah. 
Okay, so what I want to do now is I want you to think about sometimes when you're thirsty. Who can tell me sometimes when you are thirsty or when you have something to drink? When you're outside and you're really hot. Playing outside. Good. I'll just go play. Okay, when else? Um, you are hot. When you're hot? Okay. Yes. Uh, sometimes when you get dizzy, you sometimes when you drink water, sometimes it makes you not dizzy. Okay. And that's probably when you're hot. Right? No, not when you're when, hot. When, um, is. You're, um, so not when you're doing exercise, you're going to have to wait and you really need some water. Very good. Okay, how about, tell me one more idea. Sweat. When you're sweating, yes. How about when you're eating meals? Do you drink yeah, something when you're eating meals? Your breakfast, say. lunch, and dinner? I drink apple juice. I never, really get, I never get drinks. Okay, so now I want you to think about what do you drink? At these different times, what do you drink? When you're playing outside, you've been playing and you've Lemonade. gotten sweaty and hot, what do you drink? Lemonade? Yeah. Water. 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 Wait, raise your hands because I'm not going to be able to hear if everybody's shouting at the same time. Yes. Tell me something that you drink. Forgot. You forgot? Okay. It's Gatorade. Gatorade, okay. Addison. Um, ginger ale. Ginger ale. Hi. We will supply toys. Look, Addison oh. have toys. Okay. Soda. That's kind of like ginger ale. Mm -hmm. Because ginger ale is soda. Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew. That's soda. That's Mountain Dew, Coke, Pepsi, Dr. Pepper, all those. Okay. Anything else you can think of that you drink? Juice. 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 Apple juice. Good. Apple juice, orange juice. There's all different kinds of juices. Yep. Have a seat, please. What about apple juice? Chocolate milk? Yes. Um, you can, um, you remember what the, the red, the purple can is? Uh, Grape soda? Yep. Okay. Okay. All of these drinks have water in them, but some of them have other ingredients, too, that are not so good for us, like sugar. Yes. Like, too much sugar makes bad, us feel sluggish, like we were just talking about a minute ago. Like and what else does teeth. sugar do? It makes your teeth fine. It's not very good for your teeth. Do we love sugar? No. no. I do. We love sugar, really. Yeah. Sugar's good. I don't eat it? sugar anymore. But we don't need to eat too much of it or I drink too much I of it. I eat just a little bit sugar. of sugar in my cereal. Okay. So what's the best choice here, do you think? Water. Water. Yes, water is the best choice. Um, the good thing is hard to have sugar in chocolate. Okay. Shh, guys. Okay, I'm going to read. I'm going to read this quick book to you about drinking water and why drinking water is important. Okay? thirsty. Okay, water in your body. Are you thirsty? You just said you were. Raise uh -huh. your hand if you're thirsty. Okay. Did you drink lots of water today? As, raise your hand if you've had water today. Has anybody had water today? Okay, good. Most of your body is made of water. Do you know that? Not you've either. got water in your body your already. Is water. Your body needs water every day. Everything your body does on the inside depends on water. Water helps all of your body parts work right. And, and when, like if you're playing um, a kind of sport where you have to run, you, if you drink water, you run faster. <coughs> your body needs water to help digest food. Water also helps your body get rid of waste. When do we need water? You lose water when you play and sweat. Do you know that? When you sweat, there's water coming out of your body. Yeah. That, that's what it is. It's water coming out of your body, and you need to put that water back in there. Actually, it's like... So, gulp. you should take water breaks. Gulp, gulp, gulp. And what should you be gulping? Water. water. I drink a lot of water. Drink plenty of water when you're sick. If your body doesn't have enough water, it won't work its best. You can bring water wherever you go. Bring bottles of water along to the park. Does anybody take water with you when you go places? Actually, I it's a good idea. I just go sweating. 
There's like little small holes to make the sweat come out. Well, you can get some water from the foods you eat. Soup, fruits, and vegetables have lots of water. Did you know that foods have water? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I eat vegetables. Like milk, 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 is water. Water. milk is made out of water. You feel good when you drink enough water. Now it's time to play. Okay, and it is almost time to play for you guys, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, what? Yes. Look, okay, what we're going to do now is we're going to talk about two different words. I'm going to teach you two new words today. The first word is hydrated. Hydrated. And the second word, good, is dehydrated. Does anybody know what it means when you are hydrated? That means it's the same word. Um, it's it's, that means you're hot. I like no. That means you're healthy or no healthy. Hydrated means that you've got plenty of water in your body, that you've drank plenty of water. Dehydrated means no water. Yeah, no water in Good. You don't like, have enough water. I like this. I think a lot of apple juices. Tell me some ways that you can't, that you might know if you're dehydrated. Have you ever heard of somebody being dehydrated? How would you feel, do you think, if you were dehydrated? Said you would feel sick. Good. You might feel sick. Have you ever gotten a really dry mouth? Yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Okay. That means that you might be getting dehydrated. Sometimes in the morning, you can get uh, kind of like what you said. Like your throat gets really dry and your mouth gets really dry? Good. That's what I have. Mm -hmm. um, you can probably get, um, I get my lips really Sick if you don't drink no water. Oh, Good. You can get sick. It makes you feel sluggish like we talked about before. Dry mouth. How about muscle cramps? Have you ever gotten a cramp in your muscle? Yeah. I got a, I got a yep. cramp. At night, if I don't drink enough water and I go to bed at night, my muscles start cramping up and it wakes me up all night long. That means that you're dehydrated. So what should you do if you get dehydrated? I, I you drink, a lot of drink water. more water. I get Good. muscle cramps a lot. One time I got, I got sick from going on with the if you're either six or seven. I'm seven. I'm seven. Or, seven. Or, or eight. Ooh. Okay, so everybody in here is six or seven. For a six and a seven year old, you're supposed to drink about one liter of water a day. Now this is 1.5 liters. So this is a little bit more than a liter. But this is about how much water that you're I supposed to drink, drink in a day. Thing at one sip. You think you could do that? Um, the whole day? I, can I think you could. That. Okay. So I could drink all that. I could drink it, the little ones. I could drink it all the way almost to the bottom. Okay, so what I want you to start thinking about so I is I want you to pay attention to how much water you drink and I want you to try to start drinking more water. And I'm gonna give I'm gonna pass everybody out one of these. A little one? No. I'll give everybody one of these. Wait, are, this is a this is a water chart that I've made for you. And once everybody gets one. I'm going to explain what it is and what I want you to do with them. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday on here. What's today? Raise your hand. One person, tell Monday. me. Yes. Monday. Monday. So let's find Monday, which is that second column right here. And I have put on underneath Monday is one, two, three, four, five blocks. If you drink about five glasses of water a day, that'll be equal to about this one liter, this bottle of water. Okay. Which is about what you need. How many glasses of water do you need a day? Wow. About how many? Five. five. You need about five glasses of water a day. So what I want you to do, you're going to take this home with you. And what I want you to do is every time you drink a glass of water, you're going to color in a block. 
So let's pretend like I just finished a glass of water. I'm going to go to today's date, which is Monday, and I start mine at the bottom so that I can see the bar going up. And I will color in one block. So then I know how many glasses of water have I had today so far? One. One. Next time I drink a glass of water, what am I going to do? Color in another Color block. in another block. Um. So then I can see that I've had two glasses of water. So then if I drink another one, what am I going to do? Color in, another, color in block. another block. You get the idea? Yes. yes. But what happens um, when you don't drink a water on that day? I put another one. That's a good question, Spencer. What happens <laughs> if you don't drink a water on that day? I don't dehydrate. You don't color. Good, you might get dehydrated. Very good. Don't, don't, don't color anything in, and then you're going to look at that and say, "Oh my goodness, I didn't drink any water on Monday. I need to do better tomorrow." Um, um, what happens if you drink more water on Monday? Then that's great. I could have made a big, huge piece of paper with tons of blocks, but I just want you to make sure that your goal for each day is to drink at least five. Then why do you have those little buckets of blocks? A bunch of water on the start. Just a full bucket of water. Yeah, that's a good You can just be proud of yourself that you drank more than what was even on the chart. You could just write how many glasses that you had at the bottom. Okay, that's a good idea. Okay. So I wouldn't just be coloring blocks for, like if I jump more than five, I'd just put the number of you how can. many in that block. Mm -hmm. I want you to see if you can at least fill up each block, five blocks. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, tell me one more time. Why did I bring this bottle to show you? Just one person, tell me. Emma. Um, this is what? How much? How much water you should drink in a Five. day? Good, in a day. This is about how much water you should drink in a day. About how many cups did I say? Five. Or glasses? Five. five. Good. I want you to try to remember to drink at least five cups of water each day. Okay, we are going to look at a couple pictures up here. And who, let me go back. Who can remind me what these two words mean? Hydrated and dehydrated. dehydrated. Yes. If we're hydrated, we have plenty of water. water. If we're dehydrated, we did not get enough water. water. Okay? Let's look at these pictures and tell me whether you think that these people are hydrated or dehydrated. Hydrated. Yeah, everybody can say these. Hydrated or dehydrated? Hydrated. Hydrated. Good. Why? What is she doing? Drinking a lot of water. She's drinking lots of water. Okay, how about this one? Dehydrated. Dehydrated. Good. Why do you think he's dehydrated? He's sweating. He's sweating. He's sweating a lot. And he kind of looks like he doesn't feel good, doesn't he? Yeah. You think? What does he need to do? He needs to drink some water. Okay, how about this one? That one's kind of hard to see. Can you see what she's doing? Hydrated. What is she doing in that picture? She's drinking water out of the water fountain. Good. So she's hydrating herself. I always thought that was funny. Okay, how about this one? Dehydrated. Good. That one was a little bit tricky. Why do you think he looks dehydrated? Because he's like this. He's laying on his desk sleepy, isn't he? Have you ever felt really sleepy? Yeah. At school and you want to lay your head down on your head desk? Head I, bet in if, head. I bet if he drinks... I knew somebody was going to notice that. I bet if he drank some water, he would feel better, do you think? You go in a Okay, let's see. A couple more. Hydrated. Hydrated. He's playing outside. It looks like jumping on a trampoline, and he's got his bottle of water. You're going into a pattern. about this one? Dehydrated. Dehydrated. He looks like he has a headache to me, do you think? Yeah, because he's on a So he's probably could be dehydrated. Oh, yeah, and this is the last one. Hydrated. hydrated. Why do you think hydrated? They're playing and they feel good, right? And they're actually <laughs> You wouldn't have had it. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to give everybody a bottle of water. You each get a bottle of water. Ooh. And you are going to quietly go back to your seats. Once I hand you your bottle of water, you can go back to your seat. And I want you to get a crayon out of your desk. And I want you to fill in the very first block <coughs> on your water chart to show that you've had a glass of water today, okay? So as soon as you get your bottle of water, you can quietly walk back to your seat. And yes, you may open it and drink it.